a highly successful 2023 India's space agency ISRO successfully launched the PSLV C-58 mission of X-ray polarimeter satellite or X-POSAT. The satellite has been launched from the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Hari Quarter, located in the state of Andhra Pradesh after it received a green light from the mission's director. So happy new year to all of you. So on 1st January 2024, yet another successful mission of PSLV has been accomplished. PSLV C-58 has placed the primary satellite Exposat in the desired orbit of 650 kilometer, 6 degree inclination. Exposat was launched into an eastward low inclination orbit at 9.10 a.m. local time today. The mission will be studying the 50 brightest known sources in the universe and also look to unravel the mystery of black holes. This is India's first dedicated polarimetry mission. ISRO now becomes the second space agency after NASA to send a specialized astronomy observatory to study black holes and neutron stars in the Milky Way. The new satellite seeks to understand the intricacies of bright celestial X-ray sources. It will examine their complicated dynamics under harsh circumstances. The x posat spacecraft is carrying cutting-edge technology, which is designed particularly for low-Earth orbit exploration. The satellite's configuration is adapted from the IMS-2 bus platform, with the mainframe systems drawing from the heritage of IRS satellites. According to ISRO, the mission life will be about five years. X Posat carries two primary payloads, Polix, which is a polarimeter instrument that helps in taking X-rays. The second payload is Expect, which studies the X-rays and timing in space. And for more details on this, our senior correspondent Siddharth MP has sent us this report. It's the first day of the new year and the Indian Space Agency ISRO is embarking on a mission to unravel the mysteries of the universe. This is a mission known as PSLV C-58 X-ray polarimetry satellite. So the vehicle that's lifting off is the PSLV. It's lifting off on its 60th flight, a landmark flight for the rocket, which has been in service of the Indian Space Agency for more than 30 years. So the vehicle has lifted off. You can see uh, the streak of the PSLV. It's actually a bright orange streak that you can see and also the sonic boom is also heard loud and clear. That's the PSLV vehicle lifting off. This is a mission that will last about 22 minutes until satellite separation. This is a mission to unravel the mysteries of the universe. Essentially, there are X-rays coming from space to Earth. So these X-rays cannot be studied from Earth because they're blocked by Earth's atmosphere. Instead, what you do is you put a satellite around Earth and these X-rays that come from sources in space actually are studied by the satellite. And once these X-rays are studied, you can understand where these X-rays are coming from, what are the celestial and cosmic phenomenon that lead to these X-rays. So this is a science mission. This is a very niche and sophisticated mission that's mostly meant for astronomers, academia and the scientific community which is why it's not a you know hugely popular mission like Chandrayaan 3 where a lunar landing was involved where you know an Indian um, mission was involved where it landed on the moon. This is unlike that. This is more for the scientists, for the academia. It is to ensure that you know more theories and more understanding of the universe emerges. From Sri Harikota, Satish Dhawan Space Centre, Siddharth MP, Vion, World is One. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.